Hey, welcome to Hollywood Happens. I'm John McQuilk and it is Thursday, September 7th, 2006. First in the news today, Paris Hilton. And Paris, I apologize. I'm sure you're a big fan of the show, but I got to report the news. Paris Hilton was arrested last night in Hollywood on suspicion of driving under the influence. In the car with her was uh, Kimberly Stewart, who is Rod Stewart's daughter. Police determined that Paris was drunk, so they brought her into the station and arrested her. And Paris's sister, Nikki Hilton, came down to the station and bailed out her sister and drove her back home. Now this morning, Paris Hilton called in to Ryan Seacrest and spoke to him on his radio show. And Paris says, I was not drunk, it's just that I hadn't eaten all day and I had one margarita and in fact I had just left the charity function and I was on my way to In-N-Out Burger to get a burger. Well Paris, sometimes here in Hollywood, Hollywood happens. But Paris has gotten the new Miss America mad as hell. Yes, the new Miss America for 2006, her name is Jennifer Berry. She also happens to be the national spokesperson for MAD, Mothers Against Drunk Driving. Well, she has, is already speaking out. She says it's irresponsible of Paris Hilton to be drinking and driving. Well, maybe it is, but it's a little too soon to be judging Paris because so far she has not been charged with any crimes. So, but I wanted to say, this is the best thing that ever could have happened for Jennifer Berry because how many Miss Americas do we remember? Other, th other than Vanessa Williams who got her crown taken away for those nude photos. So for you, Jennifer Berry, this is your platform so you better take it and run with it. Moving on, Lindsay Lohan. She was robbed at London's Heathrow Airport. Lindsay apparently had an Hermes bag and within the bag a million dollars worth of jewelry and when she wasn't looking somebody snatched her bag. Lindsay, I've always told you take better care of your jewels. Moving on, David Letterman has signed a new contract to stay with the David Letterman show um, up until 2009. Moving on, Katie Couric. We spoke about her yesterday. She's doing really well at CBS Evening News and she's won the ratings war two days in a row. She's beating out her competitors as far as ratings go. So we just want to wish her all the best. Way to go, Katie. If you want to check out her um, tonight's show, she's going to feature 20 minute meals for under $10. So check that out. Moving on, I wanted to uh, show you Willie Ninja. He just lost his life to AIDS, Willie Ninja. Um, he was 45 years old. He is the one responsible for introducing the world to voguing. Remember how Madonna had a big hit song called Vogue? Well, she got the inspiration from the song from Willie Ninja. And you guys may remember Willie Ninja from a documentary that he starred in called Paris is Burning. Anyways, he was 45, he just passed away. May he rest in peace. Now, shout outs today. My first shout out goes to Jake Coco. He has a video here on YouTube, Blue For You, and it's been featured and so far it's received 148,000 views and it's an awesome video. So check out Jake Coco, Blue For You. And then I wanted to give a big shout out to the University of Nebraska and all the Husker fans out there and special thanks to Jojo Jeep J-O-J-O-J-E-E-P. Check out his videos. He is awesome. Well, that's it for today's show. I gotta go. If you like the show and you want to subscribe to my videos, it's, it's real easy and it doesn't cost anything. See my name, John McQuilkin? Just click on my name. When my channel page opens up, just click subscribe. Bam, you're done. You'll get my videos as soon as I upload them. And if you like videos here on YouTube, it's real important that you rate them. If you see them stars, just click on that fifth star if you enjoyed the video. Well, that's it for today's show. I thank you for watching. I thank all my new subscribers. You guys are awesome. And I'm going to have another show real, real soon. So until then, take care, everybody.